This city, like men in America, has come to a rough moment in its history. I think you should know that Durham is one of several cities in the South where my company's considering opening a branch. Our plant in Vernon, Texas, has rejuvenated a dying town. We have no unemployment. No unemployment? Hey, Anthony, who'd you rent your warehouse to? Oh, I don't remember his name. You seem very nice. You haven't changed much since high school. <laughs> yes, I have. Well, you can't tell by looking at your picture. <laughs> How about dinner again tonight? Uh, soon after every new girl that works here. And when he's through with them, they're fired. You used to go steady. I got to go. I'm going to need an assistant. Would you be interested? Mr. Leroy. Call me Gus. Gus. What kind of future is there for you here? You calling me a loser? I'll call you that if you stay here. Harris! When you look at Durham's downtown, it's dying. I believe there's an opportunity in a place that needs help. A city, after all, is just a collection of houses and buildings, hopes and dreams that depend on the determination and faith of its residents. The future can be fearful or full of promise. It's all in how you see it.